episode has plenty of snack staples from Jack Link's jerky mm -hmm. and the Pearson Nuckety to Sweet Martha's cookies. Yeah, and one Minnesota snack brand has been in our cupboards for almost 90 years. Our Derek James spent this National Potato Chip Day in Roseville <laughs> at one of the most beloved potato chip makers in the Midwest. It's the one with the windmill on the box. That snack in the windmill pack. What is it about <laughs> the box? We always wondered. You know, the box has been our best seller for a long time, and we're one of the only companies that still does it. And the beloved Rip L chips inside. It's a little thicker potato chip, and it, it's got that potato y flavor, and it's the Ma Bot. It can only be Minnesota made Old Dutch. We're kind of a classic company. Karl Marx started Old Dutch in 1934 in St. Paul. It's been in the Annenson family since 1952 and manufacturing in Roseville since 1968. The hometown chip company is also known for its signature flavors. Things like sour cream and onion, we were one of the first to that many, many years ago. There's also dill pickle, barbecue, cheddar and sour cream. Onion and garlic is my favorite, favorite chip for sure. Not only eat it, but I'll crush them up and use it for uh, uh, fish breading. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's a good recipe. Okay. New flavors are created and tested. Some hit stores, but they don't always succeed in crunch time. When the whole sriracha craze uh, was, everything was sriracha, 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 and you know we thought, boy, that'll be a that'll be a layup, and um, it it wasn't. <laughs> it Old Dutch makes a ketchup flavored chip for our neighbors to the north in Canada, but you can't get them in the U.S. We have tried it, I think, three separate times here. Same exact seasoning. It definitely delivers on ketchup flavor, but that small group of people that love ketchup just were not buying enough of it <laughs> for it to hit our thresholds to stay. Your favorite chips start with their arrival here at the plant in Roseville. 320,000 pounds of potatoes are coming into the facility today and will come out at the end of the day as chips. The potatoes run through an optical sorter and anything that isn't up to standard is removed. From there, they are cut, checked again for quality and proper moisture content before going into one of six fryers. The chips then get sorted again before they're seasoned. Last but not least, all of these ripple chips get bagged. They get put in the iconic box. They come out right here, and then they're headed to trucks going to your store. Okay, Craig, so where are we taking these? Oh, to Frank and Amelia, bro. Oh. All right, let's do this. Let's go. Whoever was in here before smaller than me. <laughs> Why yep. did you change? <laughs> That's a great that. job for you, Derek. Oh my God, right in It was fun. It was fun, and I have a special delivery for you as well. Which ones? Bring them over. Well, I'm dill yeah. dill. All right, all the way. All Classic. Yeah. You'll do those. Yes, absolutely. I've got you some. Got this chip? I've got oh, some queso, queso options what? and stuff too. Obviously, not just potato, but with the corn chips yep. and mixing things Popcorn, up. Popcorn. They make all sorts of different stuff. Good point. I'm, guys, a, I'm a Dutch crunch this? person, okay. specifically, if I had to choose one. You were I, disappointed there's no sour cream and onion on this table. I want to say the toughest part of the entire thing, though, was watching those thousands of chips oh, come yeah. and not contaminating the line by just, <laughs> just, gotta just grabbing one off sure there. Make sure good to go. Yeah, but it would have shut the entire good. line down. So I The chip barrels were fascinating, by the way. Yeah, yeah like the way that they're barrel. able to season them, and that allows them to get the exact right amount of seasoning on every single chip, which is one of the things that's changed compared to the old days of how they used to the do it. The consistency. This will make some good too. Oh, and they have a new all-dressed flavor. flavor coming out in just a couple weeks. So be looking for that. We will. All right. Thank Thanks, you, Derek. Derek. Mm -hmm.